hello guys and uh, we did number 17 and now let's do number 18 and let's practice ex18 and um, let's I'm going to use this uh, for loop to to loop maybe from one to a thousand or one to a hundred to a thousand and then we check the number that are uh, that are divisible by maybe five and, and six and eh? two numbers let's see five and six ten and nine whatever but check any number that between 100 to 1000 how many number are divisible by by six and five and see those numbers so this may be very short program so what I'm going to do is that I'm going to start with public static Void main string of argument and within our main method I would like to uh, maybe create one variable which is in count okay okay and then so my count is going to start from from one so I'm going to loop through my, let's say from uh, int i equal to um, let's say 50 you can type anything anyway so then i less or be less or equal to maybe 1000 or 2000 okay that's going to be too long and uh, let's say 1200 and then the last thing we need to uh, loop increment by one maybe i plus plus okay and then here let's check now our number so we add we write our logic within our for loop and say if uh, if i module or mind of maybe let's say with five is equal to zero and because you have to use end here because we are checking two numbers and I module six is equal to zero then let's sys out oh, let's print let's print um, count uh, plus plus mind of 10 equal to zero question mark then first thing is that we pass string builder value of boolean and I'll pass i and then here I'll append new line it's a string new line and dot to string and then we put true or false if it's true then this one if it's false then we print this side which is new string builder string dot val of i and then dot append spin 
space and then dot to string give it a space width save and run the program so you can see these are the numbers that are divisible by 5 and 6 so it might be a little bit challenging here but what I did is just I'm using the uh, Steam Builder to do all this stuff we can use uh, other other alternatives to do this so this is alternative it's very easy you ask the question and the first part of the answer up to this is true and the, this one is false so you should print either this or this so if it, uh, if this count uh, divide by 10 if it remains uh, remainder is 0 then do this otherwise do this you see so these are the space we are getting so if I add this more let's say add more space or let's say if I add something on this space this and then we say we get all this on this space if I run again you see put them here looks most nice see we can type anything if it like space so you get this space so so we are saying the more if you want more understand is what well, we are saying that whatever is divided by 10 and remain 0 print it here else print it here so it's what this is what exactly is happening. Thank you guys. Remember to subscribe and like and bye bye.